Hi, this is Hannah from the church office with this week's announcements for you. Uh, first of all, I just wanted to remind you all that we have many different growth groups throughout the week, either at the church or in people's homes. But two I'd like to highlight for you are just going to be beginning again this week. The first one is the Women's Fellowship. They meet every Tuesday at 945 in the Agape Hall, led by Linda Gamlin. They're studying Hebrews. And this week, they're having a special potluck breakfast, so it would be great if you could bring a dish to pass for that. And if you've never been or if you want more information, feel free to contact Linda or you can call me in the office and I'd be happy to direct you to some more information. Um, the second group that's also beginning this week is a new six-week study with the Marriage Connect group that's hosted by Paul and Mary Bouchier on Thursdays at 7 p.m. in their home. So if you'd like some more information on that, um, they're going to be studying managing your money in marriage. Um, you can give me a call at the church office or contact Paul or Mary as well. We also have cards with all the information with addresses, phone numbers, and details about all of our growth groups on the growth group rack outside of the sanctuary in the church. On Saturday, January 20th at 9 a.m. in the Agape Hall, I'd like to personally invite you to a group that I'm running this year. We're going to be trying something called Bible in a Year Club. This is going to be a group of people in Koinonia who are committing to reading the Bible together in a whole year. So how this is going to work is every week you'll get a weekly email reminder of what scheduled readings we're going to be doing that week. We'll read on our own, and then there might be a follow-up at the end of the week if you have some questions or you just wanted to share what you've learned. Then once a month we're going to be having these in-person gatherings that aren't mandatory, but you're most certainly welcome as we kind of come in person and discuss some things more fully. So if you're interested in this, you can feel free to give me a call or uh, see the church app to sign up. And I would love to have you join us on Saturday, January 20th at 9 a.m. Another awesome event coming up this month is the first Ladies Agape Dinner of the Year. Um, if you've never been to one of these, ask some ladies around church. They're an absolute blessing. This month, um, Rita Balia is going to be sharing her testimony of how the Lord has worked in her life. And there's also going to be some time for worship and a delicious meal with dessert included. This is a free event. All we ask is that you sign up on the church app or in the church office by Sunday the 21st. Finally, as we've reached January of a new year, 2024, I just want to remind you that you might want to grab your financial giving statement for the year of 2023. To do this, you can log into your CCB account, or if you don't know what that is, you can give me a call in the church office and I'd be more than happy to assist you with that. As always, we bring you these announcements so that we can encourage you to get out of the rows and into circles. Um, we just always need to be remembering to build one another up, to love each other, and to share our gifts with one another. We would love to see you at one of our services on Sunday at 8.30 or 10.30 a.m. And actually, we're going to be trying something new and exciting, so don't be late. So that's all the announcements for you this week. And if you ever have any questions, again, feel free to call me in the church office or see Phyllis on Sunday mornings.